uh, here with Keko Bruni. Port Helm, Keko, uh, yeah, another short day for the team. Can you give us a summary of these two past days? Yeah, I mean, uh, also today we were uh, fighting a little bit with the weather. We knew that the breeze was going to come up. It came in uh, a little bit earlier of what we were expecting. Uh, yeah, we, we had an early morning to go out and catch the early breeze, a lighter breeze, but the breeze came in earlier. But, I mean, we were pretty happy with uh, with what we had. We we hoisted the very small jeep, the, the J4. Um, and uh, we're hoping to to have some good sailing. Unfortunately, we we broke a little piece of the boat uh, that create a snowball of problems, and uh, we had to stop the day uh, to fix it for tomorrow. But that's that's life. We knew that when you are commissioning a new boat, you have to you have to deal with those things. On the helming, Keko, how different uh, would you say is the feeling compared to the LQ12 in terms of inertia and so? Uh, I'm pretty surprised with the, with the boat, with how easy it is uh, to take off. Uh, and uh, yeah, I'm obviously I'm, I'm really looking forward to push the boat and do some foiling maneuvers. Unfortunately, we didn't have the chance yet, but uh, so far the boat uh, feels very good. Is it also because of the larger foils and the legacy component? Yeah, well, we obviously we have big foils uh, because we are using la the last year foils. But uh, uh, I think the lighter, the lighter boat, la the lighter uh, assembly of the whole yacht, it's uh, making the takeoff a lot easier. Um, but again, it's very early days, and uh, I'm really hoping to have a good day tomorrow.